All right, let's give Saturday's Daily Puzzle on Chess.com a shot. This one's called The King Wears Out the Squares. It's white to move. Give the video pause and try yourself if you feel like it. So the king doesn't have anywhere to move currently. So if I could check it, that would be mate, right? Here. Oh, wait, this one. It has this square. I'm thinking about pushing this. Uh, obviously, my knight could be taken. But then there would be this. Huh, okay, so that seems interesting. The knight has this. So... I'm, my knight is under attack here, but I'm thinking if I push this pawn, king has to take, bishop here, he probably has to go here, can I let go of the bishop as well, so I mean I would have this check, but the king would take my bishop I think, or yeah, the king would take my bishop, and then like can I get in here, is that working? No, the, the knight's here, so I was thinking maybe I could get my rook to here eventually, but I don't think I can. Um, I don't know if this is work. If this works, I'm just really lucky that I looked at this move first. Here, 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 all is forced. Here, pretty sure forces this. It's so hard to to visualize a position after all these moves. Uh, but I think this square is still open for the king, and then I. But I think I can bring my rook in. But I'm pretty sure the king is just escaping out here. And I'm pretty much out of pieces at this point. I mean, this pawn put, it just feels like it has to happen. Like, what other what other stuff do I have? This, oh, I hadn't... Why hadn't I considered this? Here? Okay, because that, un, that uncovers this. And then, the, like, I feel like if the king gets over here, it's over. Alright, I feel like it has to be some version of, of this order, right? I, ha, I mean, this is... This has to be the check. He... The king can't go this way. I can't let that happen. I wouldn't think. It feels like I have to draw the king into this area. And I feel like this is the way to do it. Here. Here. And then this has to happen. And then here. And then what am I... What am I doing? I can support the bishop. Is that working? Maybe. That might work. Is there a way to stop that? I can bring the rook here, and I feel like the king has no moves. I mean, this is a lot to calculate after a couple a couple forced moves. So here, 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 right? And then the king has to come here, and then I think this really weaves a mating net, and I don't see a piece that's that close to be able to stop this. And then, and then I'm threatening king here. I feel like maybe the knight can sacrifice. This has to be the line, right? I'm going for it. And then this, I feel like this move I have to make. And then the king comes here. And this is, this is where I, this is where I'm unsure. This looks really good. It's two moves though. It's slow. But right now the king has nowhere to move. This supports my bishop. This knight isn't, so I can lose this knight. I'm not worried about that. As long as I support this bishop with something. And, and then the, the rook coming in would be mate. Um... Is there anything black can do? Like, this might prevent it. Is this... Oh, but I'm threatening mate here, too, right? No, because the king... Yeah, yeah, I am. After I support the bishop, I'm threatening the, threatening mate with the knight or the rook. There's no way black can stop both of those things. There's no way. If this... Then... I can just... Yeah, you can't do that. It's too slow. Okay, wait. Here... So here... If here... I can do... I can do both. I mean, like... There's no way. There's no way you can stop this. Right? Please? Okay. This knight move. I have two different options. Which one Which one do I do first? Why does it matter? Oh, God. Why does it matter? Why does it matter which one I do first? Here. Wait a second. Here. They're both checkmate. The knight has to take, and then I just go here. Or I go here. The knight has to take, and I go here, right? No, because this square needs to be taken. So I go here first. Yeah, I have to hold this square with the rook. Okay, so I here with the knight first, draws the knight over here, and then this is me. Dude, that's a pause, baby! I don't know. I don't know how people thought that was. I guess, I mean, there weren't that many good checks. There was one really good one, but the line was tough, I thought, once it started going. How many, how, how many moves was that? That was a lot of moves. It was a force mate in, like, six. Um, okay. So, I mean, first things I looked at were these, these knight checks. 
that just didn't look that good. I felt like if, if the king starts scooting over here, it's sort of escaping. This looked especially good to me because it's forced move, take the knight. It has to, the knight has to be taken. And then the fact that all these pieces were communicating like this just seemed, it seemed enticing, you know? So if I, if I check here, king takes, that's forced. Now I bring the bishop in, and this next move I thought was the trickiest because the king gets to here, and it's kind of like, it can't really move, but what are you doing? And you slowly protect your bishop so that it frees up your knight and gives protection to your, your rook on this square. This is a huge move, protecting the bishop, protecting this square. And since the bishop is protected, now your knight can jump in. And there's just nothing black can do. Uh, black has, has a full move to try to make something happen here to protect the king. But you have too many threats. The knight comes in. And this is where I got a little confused. Um, can't go here first because if you lose the rook, this is no longer checkmate because the king has this square. Rook has to hold this square. So you jump in with the knight first, giving a check. Knight has to take that. Otherwise, it's checkmate. It's a forced take there. And now this is no longer protected. So you jump in here and that's a mate. That's the pause, baby. Thanks for watching. Catch you later.